this is a video about creating the images for uh, the heritage trail in Bush Mills which will be used on the newly designed panels Um, here's Ross Wilson's Alphabet Angel sculpture, uh, cartoonized. There's quite a lot of work goes into the illustrations. Now I was using a light box, uh, makes makes a job far easier uh, because when you're pushed for time and you want accuracy, at the end of the day, a light box helps you. But a light box can help you trace um, the image gets a more accurate illustration so it involves a lot of just uh, what I'd call tracing I know a lot of people don't like that one but that's so sort of, you're getting the basic outline and from there you just start adding colour now I used a bit more vibrant colours um, as opposed to uh, how they are in real life uh, because in Northern Ireland as most people know the sun is not always very bright in the sky so Sometimes to get a, a, a better image, you you, uh, you you tend to sort of help it along a bit with uh, brighter colours. Here's Klondike Terrace. So here I am sticking down a bit of masking tape onto a, a page to sketch Shell Row and as you can see after the after it comes off the light box you've got your sketch and then you just draw in by hand all the all the wee parts that kind of make it more handcrafted I mean it is, cra it is handcrafted at the end of the day uh, even if I had a wee bit of help from uh, the light box there <laughs> um, it's really kind of getting the point across um, about these different heritage uh, areas or site um, around Bush Mills because often they're not maybe not easily identifiable really I mean you could walk past a few of those uh, heritage areas and not even realize here is a tram that goes from Port Bound Tray all the way right into the north coast up and up to the Giants Causeway area. And last but not least is the Bushmills Distillery. It's very difficult to actually get into the grounds if you're a, a regular person like myself, so I had to borrow a few pictures um, which I found elsewhere. It's not my own picture. Um, 
but, I did, but time was of the essence and I needed to just get damage out there and I think it's turned out pretty good. It's the kind of uh, photographic shot um, that is not, in my view, it's maybe not necessarily open to the public. It's possible maybe if you've paid your way in, uh, it's possible that's part of the tour area, I'm not really sure. Um, coming up coming up here is the final, how the final panel should look. Um, a few minor um, changes possibly. Uh, so here's a lot, all the different heritage locations. Um, which is going to be placed on the final panel. It's, a, it's kind of a work in progress this map at the minute, but it's pretty much complete. Thanks for watching, and uh, have a good day.